Welcome back to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we're heading south to Cinnabar Island. Yay, look at that, I fucking remembered what the fuck it's called, and Mofo's using surf, so we're gonna surf on this Mofo. You like that? You like that? You should. You should. I'm gonna... I'm gonna I know I used to cut... I caught a Tangela in here way back. Yeah, look at that, motherfucker's right there! That's not really what I'm looking for, though. Um, what I'm doing is I'm kind of surveying the land, because... At some point, we're gonna need to grind. And this guy's an asshole. I don't know how you poison Chode, but fuck you. Um, yeah, fuck you, I get it, he's poison, asshole. Um, we're gonna need to, to grind at some point, and I'm just kind of taking a look at where a good place would be to grind, because Chode, uh, Chode, not necessarily Chode. Not necessarily chode, but um, uh, obviously Mofo is gonna need gonna need some some levels and all that good shit. And yeah, that's pretty much pretty much it. Either that or honestly, like I said, we could just go get they're the same level, so you're really not losing much getting the Star and stuff. And where the fuck are my full heels? There they are. That's what I need to waste on you, you poor thing. And unfortunately, yeah, we are gonna have to lead with Chode, but, um, problem being, I'm gonna have to go check my TMs and check around and take a look at TMs and stuff, because you know what? These guys, we might, hmm, hmm, I'm getting devious thoughts here. I'm pretty sure these, oh, I don't want to look at that. Um, there, get in. And I think, Blaine has some, some relatively high Pokemon. I want to say they're like mid 40s, I think. I could be wrong. What the fuck is with the crazy ass sand there, son? Alright. Yeah, these guys should have like sea kings and stuff that we can grow fat and happy on with McKenna. That's really what I'm looking for. Um, obviously we have Pokemon Mansion and all that good shit to do too. There. And, and shit. So, once we go there and do that, um, see what level everything is in there. Should be alright. I think, if I remember right, I think there's like ponytails and shit like that. And I know there's ditto. But I think there's like ponytails and shit like that. Something that our water type can grow fat and happy on and, and eat up while we're in there. Um, but that's as much as I remember, honestly. I don't remember a whole lot of fucking anything being on Cinnabar Island. Honestly. I mean, other than Missing No. Missing No was there, right? I think it was there. But anyway, yeah, I, I did all that shit when I was a kid. I can't fucking remember how to do any of that shit now. Are you kidding me? Fuck that. That was like 20 fucking years ago almost. Goddamn. Goddamn. Okay, not really. Oh, well, I guess it was kind of almost 20 years ago. Holy shit. We're getting old. I'm getting old. You're probably not old. You're probably like fucking four. Watching this. No, I'm just kidding. I don't think a four year old could make it this far. I'm not insulting your intelligence. Not yet, anyway. Maybe some other day. Maybe. 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 I'll, I'm not really sure yet. I mean, it just depends on how much of a douche you are to me. That's right. I, I like talking there. Yeah, mofo. Yeah, I love it. Um, depending on when this LP is over, I mean, I may or may not have a fucking, what you call it, a 3DS capture card. That really all depends on whether or not he has any for order or anything like that. Um, and, and if I do, then I may just go ahead and play it. Play, play my copy of Soul Silver and and all that shit. And then we can. I mean, we can still get shit like a Geo Dude, and I might actually do that just because Geo Dude's available and in that game, and I would use Geo Dude fucking forever and all that shit. By the way, we're gonna get Earthquake here soon, and you do not know how much shit that is going to rock. Speaking of, I don't even remember if we have anybody to fight in Viridian City Gym, or if it's just Giovanni. I assume we have some fucking Team Rocket Thugs to beat up, but I'm not entirely sure. And why they fucking give people magic cards like this is fucking beyond me. Absolutely beyond me. I mean, I mean, this isn't even worth the fucking time, honestly. 
I mean, sure, if I was switch train, I'm not even switch training anything. If I had something level five, I could go in here and beat up this shit. That'd be great. But we we sadly don't. So we're here to fucking ward off the onslaught of magic carps with a whole lot of vine. I was gonna use six vine hopes on these fuckers. Ah, uh, good shit. Good shit. And I know in the water, I know in the water out here, uh, kind of harking back to the shit I was saying about where to train and stuff. I know in the water right here that we're looking at, there's tentacles and all that sort of bullshit that you don't ever want to fucking see, really. I mean, like, the second most common, yeah, and it's like level 11. I always hated that shit. Always hated that shit. Anyway, let's, let's fuck up these two. Yeah. Lil and Ian. Double battle, perhaps? Yay! Double battle! Don't tell me... Okay, I was gonna say, don't tell me fucking... Dirt Machine is, is out there, because that would kind of fuck up everything. Just, just a little bit. Um... Oh! Oh, I, I didn't mention this, but I did look ahead to the Elite Four and all that shit. It's gonna be interesting. Um, unfortunately, looking at our group and looking at what the Elite Four has, it may pretty much just be like a three Pokemon show because if we're gonna match up types and shit like that, um, it really does look like only a handful of these guys are gonna be useful. Um, mostly Chode showed Mokana a little bit um, because of what's his name has rock and fighting and um, Stella is gonna be pretty useful in there as well I think if I remember right um yeah the only thing that really frightens me is wankers level 63 I think level 63 Charizard not quite sure what we want to do about that considering we don't have anything with great um with, with great uh what do you want to call it like rock moves or something like that um so yeah we may kind of be yeah i don't know at we'll see i know i think i use dirt machine or or chode we could use chode and chode is faster god damn that guy fuck you um, Chode might be able to handle him now that I think about it, because he is part flying and he can just fucking spark his ass or whatever. Um, haha, <laughs> yeah, but it won't fucking matter because he used Constrict like a prick. But anyway, we got Sonic Boom, so I'm just gonna fucking Sonic Boom your shit up. But, um, yeah, so see what I mean? It's, it's gonna be pretty. Uh, I mean, I don't really see, unfortunately, I don't see much use for Granker. And if we do use Granker, which I would love to, I have no reason, you know, to, to not want to use them, really. And if we do use them, the problem is we'll be using them on the same Pokemon Volcano would be fucking up, I think. I think, because I think the stuff that What's-His-Name has that's rock and fighting is like rock and ground. So, you know, uh, yeah. I mean, obviously, you see four times effective or just two times effective, it's... You know, it, it, it's kind of a, you know, pick your own poison sort of thing. Is this fucker ice yet? Let's find out. I know Shelter has a ton of D and would be one that I would be interested in using, but I don't you need that fucking... I need something to evolve. Am I going to water stone or some dumb shit? Yeah, Cloyster will stay in just to see how badly we get fucked by a Cloyster. Because I think, I think one of the Elite Fours is like water ice. Which, once again, won't be much problem, I don't think, because the ones that are just straight water, we can obviously roll Volcano with, and then the ice ones. We could use Granker, I think. But the water ice has these, we can just roll uh, Chode onto and just fucking spark them. I mean, uh, that's not a bad idea, right? Hey, buddy. He, he doesn't want to fight because we're in the water. And he's scared. He's scared. Sorry that I'm like fighting each and every fucker out here, but we kind of kind of need to level some guys up. I mean, just saying. Um, obviously, we will have like Victory Road, which is usually the place that I I usually just wait till Victory Road and grind a bit in there, 
like right outside the Pokemon Center at the ass end of it before you go fight the Elite Four and all that shit. That's usually what I do when I play the game. So I may just end up doing that. I don't really know. I mean, I'm kind of kind of undecided as to what I want to do with 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 Omanite. I mean, we're obviously gonna go fucking get him and and make him be a thing and not a fossil. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna make that happen regardless, and we'll just have to see what we what we really want to do. Um. So yeah, I mean, I could use Lapras, and Lapras would be fine because they really don't have anything to stand up to a Lapras, honestly. Um. I mean, I think there may be like, what's his name's Execute that maybe would give Lapras a bit of an issue. Because of the, maybe having plants up, but it's also psychic, and I suspect it would be more psychic heavy. Considering execute, I don't think is all that great of fucking plant moves, other than like solar beam or some shit like that. But yeah, um, what's his name does look like a uh, fucking dragon guy, fucking Lance or whatever the fuck his name is. Or, or am I getting my games mixed up? I probably get my games mixed up, but. The, the, I think it's the Elite Four leader or whatever the fucking, not the champion, which is wanker, but whatever their fucking ring leader is. I think he's got dragon type, and if I remember right, he shouldn't be too bad. I think we've got a lot of things to take his shit out and, and knock him down and pick. Obviously, if we also have a Lapras, and it being ice and all that shit, you know, with an ice beam or some shit, you know, I, I gotta go check into that too, and check into Lapras' move pool in this game, and... Ah, no. Fuck growth. I'm not, yeah, stop learning growth. Why would you learn growth at level 41? I don't know. Why don't you learn better stuff? 148 bucks, man. We didn't get shit from. Hey, fuck you, land. Fuck you. Should be a goodie here at least. God damn it. Oh my god. Feel the sun and the wind. Feel it. They should be coming to the end here soon. That's that's why I keep kind of I ended this episode. I don't really want to end it, you know, and then, like pick it up and be like five minutes of us getting to the other side. So I'm just gonna make this because this is sort of a shorter route. I'm just gonna make this one whole episode and like fuck it. And then, like I said, I mean we don't have that many that many episodes left in this LP, so. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna get out. Uh, the victory road is probably gonna be like four or five. It's Cause fuck victory road. I hate that place. That's the that's the number one place that I hate in every Pokemon game by far. And I think a lot of people can sympathize with that. Cause no one likes that whack ass bullshit. I mean, it's really a pain in the ass. And I'm gonna kind of trust or test my luck here with with this Seedra. Cause I don't really know what this fucker might have. I'm not sure if in Gen 3 they made him the fucking dragon ice water fucking thing he is. I don't, I don't remember, because I think he learned some ice moves. If I remember right. If I remember right, because I remember in one, like, might have been Gen 5, where I tried to use a fucking Venusaur on one, and it just fucking would not take damage. And that was bullshit. How was that one bitch's gym too? And she was a fucking asshole. I hate dragon. And that's one of the types I don't like in this game. I don't like dragon. I don't like anything about it. I mean, I I don't like its. Uh, I honestly didn't think it was all that imbalanced, but I hate its imbalanced perception. And I don't like the fact that it's weak to ice or its own fucking type. I think both of those are kind of dumb. That's just me. I mean, I can understand just the ice type and then adding fairy, but fuck you. God damn it, listen. And now the fact that they added all sorts of shit in Gen 6 and made it just absolutely piss poor, in my opinion. Same thing with fucking Metagross. I know people were bitching that Mega uh, Mega Metagross is a thing, and everyone's like, arr, 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 you know, and the way they fucking gimped Metagross. I don't fucking give a shit, because I love Metagross, and I will use him any day. All the fucking time. Ayo, and then here we are. Cinnabar Island. Oh, the door. I did not try to go in there. I wanted to walk by and, and go in here. Old guy. 
Don't we have to go through the Pokemon Mansion thing and fucking find him or some dumb shit? Anyway, um, I'm gonna heal here and end this episode. It's probably a good 15 minutes long. It's, it's a nice long episode-ish for ya. A vast virus Thank you, database Avast, has been updated. for telling me my shit. I got that annoying the fucking bejesus out of me. Close. I, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> If you made it this far on YouTube, you know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching, and don't mind my antivirus. It lies. Seriously. Anyway, pants are optional.